All right, y'all. Color of skin is just an illusion, delusion. We're all one through light, Christ. We're all energy, God. Ain't nobody over us, ain't nobody under us. We're all the same, man. We're all in this together, one nation, one life. It's my partner, Capa Carter. Cap, Cap, Cap Carter. Fresh veggies. Grow house, fresh veggies. Grow house. One nation, one, one light. One nation, one light. Combined together, we are grow, grow light. Grow light. Grow light represents God. You know what I'm saying? We are the seeds, we're growing. We are the fresh veggies, the, trying human, the people. Trying to the spread beans. a positive message, you know what I'm saying? So we do it through positive energy and positive ways, through this music, to reach out to the older folks and to the kids, where everybody can listen to it without cussing in our music. Especially, we doing especially to the kids, man. Especially to the youngins, man. They're the most influence, influenceable. Our so, future. You know what I'm saying? Like, like that's our future right there, man. Like, like I got two youngins myself. So you know what I'm work with BK. Thank yes, you BK. Appreciate That's it. my Appreciate bro, man. He was, he's, one, he's one of my day ones when I first got into the music scene, man. In Montgomery, man, he was one of the first ones that was like, "You, you dope, bro." Like everybody else was sleeping on me, but he was there from the get go. Still my sleeping. Man, BK. Still and sleeping. They still man. sleeping, bro. They still sleeping. Crazy. They ain't gonna be sleeping for too much longer, man. I got some surprises coming. I got some, got some big surprises coming. I want to tell y'all normally the spoiler spiller, but I ain't gonna do it this time. I'm gonna let y'all see it for yourself. Yeah, I can't can't speak on it too much, man. I can't give you too much, man. Cause then y'all try to jump the gun and do it before we do it. We ain't Dang, having man. that. We, we, we ain't having that. We ain't having that, man. Got to be original. And, <laughs> and that, that's my biggest problem with these folks out here, man. Ain't nobody doing nothing original. Original, man. yeah. Man, everything is, everything is copycat. Y'all talking about the same stuff. Yeah, y'all make y'all doing the same type of beats. So y'all want this new... type beat, that type beat. Ain't no type beat, man. Just just. Just Do find it. something that you feel, bro. Like, don't feel it because somebody else did it first. We're bringing feel a new it way. because you felt it in your soul, man. That's what being an artist is about, man. You gotta feel what you're doing. Can't just see, can't just let other people see, man. It, it's so much deeper than eyesight, so much deeper than what you view superficially, man. This is a spiritual thing, man. This is a spirit thing. This is a soul thing, man. Like, my soul been on fire for creation, for, for artistic creation vision since I was a youngin man like and I've been doing music since I was like nine bro yeah. like nine years old singing in a church you know what I'm saying so you know this video shoot man like it's just going back to my roots for real like like I it, it's, it's like God had a plan for me to to you know do this in the church yeah it's crazy it's crazy how that works man and then, like, with this coronavirus and all this stuff going on, going around, you know what I'm saying? We're still out here, man, doing God's work, man. We got to do what we got to do. But, 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 six feet. <laughs> like, that's some serious stuff, man. This, this corona stuff, man, like, like my mom even, like, I told her I was shooting a video today. She's like, you need to stay home, you know? And and not not to not to make fun of my mama, you know, she she cares. That's, that's the thing. And she knows how serious it is, man. And I do too, man, like. Like the whole point of us doing this is is to get it done before things get more serious. Yeah. Things that I'm not man. It's a purpose in it, dude. Yeah. Thing, things are gonna get worse. Yeah. Things are going to go down that people are not gonna have any control over. Like that's a that's, that's a, just the beginning. That is all the way across the globe. People are dying, falling out, man. Bro, this left is and right, man. So left stay prayed up, man. Pray, pray, for, pray, pray, man. Pray for your family. Believe. Pray, pray, believe pray God to God. Got you covered. Pray to the God you pray to. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, man, pray to the God you pray to, because we all come from the same God. Yeah. Like wherever, wherever you pray to, you pray to the same. You, you a Buddhist, you pray to the same God that the Christians pray to. It's, it's all the same God. We may all have a different understanding, but we all came from the same place. We didn't come from a different place. Amen. We all, we all from the same, same seed, man. It started as a thought. Hmm. Yep. Like you can't put a price on a thought. That's that's that's. You know what I'm saying? Like this ain't about money. This ain't about fame. This ain't about. This ain't about being able to flaunt. This ain't about owning things. This is about doing what our spirit leads us to do. Because the spirit that's in us is the spirit of God, man. It don't it don't matter, man. Like if I if you ain't doing evil, you got God in you. Right is right. Wrong is wrong. Tell you, man. Look at it. And no in between. Well, you gotta do God's work, man, because anything other than that is the devil's work. Amen. It's, it's, uh, I, 
don't know, man. It, it, this this so whole this, talk about. Yeah. dude, this, this is a whole story. Get it out. Get it out. This is just a, a chapter Run in it. a long, like, roller coaster ride of a story, man. Yeah, man. Dude, this, if you'd have seen this dude ten years ago, bro, like this man, this man right here, like I didn't know him before he was who he is now. But just knowing the story that he came from, knowing the place that he was, like it's a, it's a, it's, it's a, it's by the grace of God and by only the grace of God that he's still here, doing this, man. Like, yeah. like, and and you know, a lot of people, a lot of people are real skeptical about certain folks, especially folks like us, because of where we came from. But man, this dude has never switched up on me. This dude has never, ever, ever done anything. For himself, he's always been a selfless individual, man. As far as I, it's, it's since I've known him, you know what I'm saying. So like, it's a, it, it just shocks me that, that he was who he was versus who he is now. Like, you could tell God really came into his life and worked on this man. God can use anybody, man. You just gotta be willing, man. You gotta choose to be chosen. Bro, you make that choice. Shoot. It's on. See how far you done came, bro. You been for, through the mud, man. For three like, years, man. I was a straight junkie, bro. Like straight through the straight mud. Straight junkie, I, man. I believe in you, man. I knew God could change you, so I just I wasn't gonna give up on you. Oh man, if you only knew how if you only knew the story of how this even started, like, bro, it's it's such a long story, man. We ain't even got enough time in the vlog to start and it's only been like what a year and a half since we started working together. Yeah. Mm. Man, got a lot of so man. much has happened in Dropped a an year and some months. Capricorda and Shaman P, Shaman P and Capricorda, Grow Light, we dropped that album together. It's on all uh, music platforms, Spotify, YouTube. You just type in Shaman P and Capricorda, Grow Light, and it'll pop up. You'll see our music videos coming through, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, man. When we drop this music video, you type in on um, Shaman P and Kevin Carter, and it's going to be up under the blog, up under the Shaman P and Kevin Carter um, page. You'll see this vlog. You'll see the video behind this vlog. Yep. You'll see Got That Vision. You'll see the whole Grow Light album. You'll see my new album, It's Me But It Rainbow. Isn't Me, featuring the, the track uh, DNA for the video we shot today. You'll see Nutrition. That's the song that started it all right there, Nutrition. And that'll be that'll probably be the next video Alabama we shoot too. Alabama <laughs> nine, ten, and eleven, ain't it? Yeah, Alabama massacre. I started out, man. Uh, what's really getting me the attention right now? I ain't even gonna lie, man. Big shout out to Noah Baker and We Global Enterprise. Big shout out, man, because it all started with like an Alabama massacre challenge, man. Like you got the best verse, you'll get on, you you you'll get a spot on the next massacre, you know. And it was nine, and I just decided, man, like why not give it a try? I wasn't guaranteed. I wasn't like. I wasn't like saying, I know I'm gonna get this, but I fought for it, you see what I'm saying? I worked for it and I did my best, man. Like all these people out here that are just saying whatever into a mic, don't got no vision, don't got no direction, saying the same thing the next guy said, talking about drugs, talking about money, talking about women, talking about this, that, and the other that's fleeting, all of it, fleeting. It always fades. Spiritual, spiritually speaking, this body is only a vessel. It's a temporary vessel. We have to do our best to use this vessel to bring good into this world. But I digress. Alabama Master 9, man. I did the challenge. You know, got over, what, 3,000 views on it before it got shut down on Facebook because I got banned <laughs> uh, for oversharing. Troublemaker. <laughs> I'm a troublemaker because I shared my videos, but uh, you know, and, and when it came down to the vote, man, I got like 78, 79 votes, and uh, I eventually got the spot, man. And it's all it's been all down, it's like it's it's all been down from there, man. Like like ever since the first time I worked with Noah, like he's been inviting me back to the massacres, man. I I, I invested in the spots, man. I've been on ten. Uh, 11's about to drop on the 10th, and uh, I'm, I'm already in cahoots with him on, on 12, man. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm ready, man. And uh, where we go from there, it, it, it all, we, we'll, we'll just see. You know, like, that, that chapter hasn't been written yet, but it's coming, man. I'm just so excited to, I'm so excited to be a part of that and, because it's growing, man. Like, I came in at the right time, like, the exact right time because wow. this, this Alabama massacre and We Global, 
enterprises movement is just blowing up so big, so quick, man. Like it's shout out it's to Lynn and Shannon too. It's growing, man. yeah, man. Shout out to Lynn and Shannon Hupel for the Montgomery Advertiser, man. Because yeah. if, if it wasn't for them last year, we we wouldn't have got our article, man. We wouldn't have got the article for our Grow Light album, and uh, you know they did a lot. They did a lot for us, man. We joined the Montgomery Area Musicians Association. Um, started doing some work with them. Did a few charities for them, uh, you know. Brought a few more artists to the table to to get interviewed, and uh, you know. Sh also, shout out to Young Road, man, because uh, yeah. you know he's Thank the producer. You, yeah. He's the producer for the DNA track. Um, I actually won that beat in a uh, in, in a, a, a hot 16 challenge. So you know, I I, I, I told myself I was gonna get somewhere using using my music and using my lyrical ability and. You know, I, I I kept my own promise to myself. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it, Ugh. Ugh. but six feet though. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. Uh, so what, what I realized though, what I re the, the main thing that I realized <laughs> though, bro, it doesn't take. It takes more than just talent alone, man. Like, things didn't really start popping off until I started really investing. Like. I don't have much, but what I have, I put towards my music, and it, I, I hadn't seen nothing but progress and, and success from it. Like, I'm not talking wealth, because wealth doesn't measure success. See, or, well, success isn't measured in wealth, it isn't measured in popularity, notoriety, it's not. It's measured in how you feel about yourself at the end of every day. And how I feel about myself at the end of every day is that I'm doing what God has put me here to do, and however long it takes, However much work it takes, I'm going to do it. You know, if I have to take a break, I'm going to take a break. If I have to lay low, I'm going to lay low. If I have to go to a church that where nobody knows who I am and and sing a few songs into a mic using a Bluetooth speaker for my for my sound system, then I'm going to do it. Right. That's a true story, by the way. That actually just happened. Big shout out to Swiper No Swiping. He's, uh, he's one of the producers that I use for my beats, uh, him and uh, Rogue Scholar. Big, yeah. big shout out to Rogue big Scholar. Big shout out to Rogue Scholar, man. Uh, but, but Swipe invited me to uh, to the church that his dad's a pastor at to uh, to do a few songs for their for their Musicians Appreciation Day. And, uh, you know, I, I, not that this is really a big factor, but, you know, I was the only white guy in the room. <laughs> so everybody was looking at me, you know, when I came in there, his daddy was like, so you gonna sing for us? I said, I said well, I'm gonna rap. He said, you go rap. Like he was just, he was, <laughs> it just, he was just floored by it. And uh, you know, he, he he called me up. He said, we got a gospel rapper in the house today. <laughs> uh, called me up, I did my songs, and it was just like everybody in the room was, oh my God, yeah. oh man, praise yeah. Jesus. Yeah. You know, uh, you had, like, you the youngest, like Jesus, the youngest okay. in the room had their phones out recording me. Uh, Bishop Douglas was like, don't be surprised if you end up on Instagram or Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and, and, and to top it all off, man, at the end of the service, after he did his sermon and everything, he asked me to come up and do another song to close out the service. So that in itself, that in of itself is huge. You know huge how hard it is to get, get them to just give us a chance, man. That, it really is, man. And, and it's true what they it's true what they say, man. Like if you know if you know people. It, yeah. it doesn't matter. Like you, you never know who you know. Yes. You never know who will be the one or be the people that will help you out. Like you keep your circle small because you can't trust everybody. Yeah. But you, you let their actions speak for them. Like you see what they do for you. You see what they will do for you. Whether or not you go out of your way to help them in any way, that's how you really know that that these people got your back. That they're on your side, especially. I've been in this this hip hop scene for about nine years, man. Nine long years. I have struggled to to even so much get some ears open to hear what I had to say. And as soon as I switched my message up, started talking about positive things, started start you know eliminated all swearing in my music. That started getting people's attention. When I started doing challenges on on social media, that started getting people's attention. It was like a domino effect like I did one thing and that led to another and that led to another and that led to another 
Shout hey, out Rick. to our mama, man. She really is amazing, man. His mama supports him, finally. After I changed the message, man. <laughs> yeah. she changed the message. Like, she couldn't condone what I was doing because I was saying things that were negative, man. I was doing what everybody else was doing because I thought that was what I had to do to get my foot in the door. And guess what? It didn't, it didn't work. work. It did not work. Not one iota. Why? Because I blended in. I did. I, 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 I was uniform to what everybody else was doing. There was nothing going on that was original. Aside from my lyrical content, that was, you know, aside from my lyrical ability, there was nothing new about me. There was nothing original about me. There are plenty of white boy rappers that can spit like I spit. But they all talk about the same thing, yep, yep. like like yeah, like zone. like even Eminem, man. Like I know that's 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 a popular white rapper that that everybody compares me to just because I'm a white guy. But at the same time, he's even shifted his his focus to a different subject. Like you look at him from Music to Be Murdered by versus the Slim Shady LP back in '98, bro. He has done so much since then and come from basically nothing to everything and he is talking about different things he's talking about things that matter he's not just he's not just saying the same thing everybody else is saying and that's what helps him still stay relevant in the industry as a big artist shout out to amanda nelson chastastic chastastic shout out to her man she got my back man she behind us on everything we do and i appreciate that and bro, i'm i'm just I'm extremely thankful to be here, man. Be be on it, man. And be be at this point in my life, man. Like like where it goes from here, I don't know. It don't bother me where I go as long as I still got music and I still got God. Like this this is this is I'm content with this right now. If it grows, great. I mean which, you know, it's inevitable if you continue to work, you continue to grow. Shout out to Aaron S. Rucker and um Trapper Jenkins with the one Nation One Light reality show that Aaron's shooting for us, man. And Trapper, Trapper doing that. Um, uh, what is it? Spot? What is it? What, it's what is a it? podcast. Slipper Gang, Slipper Gang Radio podcast. Podcast that he got me a co-host on. Shout out to them on that. Doing big things, man. Just everybody in the team is working, man. Oh yeah. Yeah. And that's about covers it. That about covers everything, man. <laughs> I hate to end it like that. <laughs> <laughs>